Haitaji kujua vitu vingi kutoka kwa harmonize. Tukuja kumvamia kidogo akiwa studio, anafanya mazoezi kidogo na itari yeso sasa. Viko vitu vingi sana tunataka kujua kutoka kwake. Hame tunalia kitu gani kwenye album hii ya Afroist na kwanini ya meita Afroist na kuwaje kwenye boy. Shari bada mambo vipi? Mishika bisa. Mm. Afroist ni album. Wow, well, Afroist. Meita Afroist mziki wangu sabu. Yani, uh, the meaning of Afroist ni sound from East Africa. Uh, natamani sisi East Africa na manisha Kenya, Uganda, Burundi, Rwanda, uh, Somalia tuwe na sound yetu mba ndo Afro East na tuwe Afro East kwa sababu Tanzania tuna bongo flavor Kenya wana mziki wana ituwa genge kitu kama hicho na hata Uganda pia wana mziki wao Rwanda the same so atuna ile sound mba ina combine sisi wote tukasema ok this is our music kwa sababu ukienda okay, ulaya marikano kusema nafanya Afro beat wana kuliza are you from Nigeria? kwa sababu Nigeria washa present atangu wenzizu wakina fella kuti uh, so wakina whiskey they are doing very good and also again like in a bana boy you are doing very good so what should you introduce it so me i wish kill a record and bio you know kiswahili ndani yake kwa sababu afro east any east african luga kubwa ambayo inazungumzwa sana ni kiswahili so natamani kila ngoma ambayo ina kiswahili ndani yake basi tuite afro east so that's our sound so that's my wish um yeah so nikasema kwamba okay kwa sababu this is a sound from east africa i just need to album yangu afro east that's the meaning yeah Um, ulikuwa umesema kwamba utaiachia mwezi wa pili lakini haikuwa hivyo. Kwa nini ulichagua siku ya birthday yako ndio uweze ku launch album yako? Yeah man, it wasn't too easy to put everything together, everyone together, so many giants is in the same book. Sio kitu rahisi kwa sababu kila mtu anakuwa na program zake, ratiba zake za kuchia ngoma. So kumekuwa na more collaborations na nje na zandani na unajua sanii kila mtu anakuwa na ratiba zake. So it can take time lakini tukubaliana toke kwenye March ni machi trais so ngano kabisa kwamba my birthdays nipo karibu ngasema kwa ni story siku hiyo tu kwa sababu itakuwa ni kama zaadi na jizaadi ya mwenyewe katika siku ngo kuzaliwa and this is my first album ever yeah. yes never give up ni moja kati ya ngoma ambayo imeenda viral sana na moja kati ya ngoma ambayo imependwa sana mtaani na inspire vijana wengi watu wengi walitegemea kuiona itakuwa namba moja kwenye album yake lakini imeshangazwa kuona uh, namba never give up sio namba moja katika uh, list ya ngoma zako. Well, it doesn't yeah, imanish kwamba ngoma zingine ambazo zimeka namba moja ni nzuri na hapana. Kwa sababu mimi siwezi kuja jimbo nzuri. Mimi ukiona nyimbo nimekuwa kwenye album basi ujue ni kali. So mashabiki wanaweza kuja jini kali sio kali. Lakini before plan yangu haikuwa kuweka nyimbo yote ambayo ishasikika mtaani kwenye album. Nataka niweke mawe mapya tu. Lakini nikaja kugundua kwamba never give up ni inspiration story ni ngoma ambayo inakufanya umfahamu harmonize kiundani yani umjue amezaliwa wapi amekulia wapi ametokea wapi nini so nikona kabisa kwamba imetoka sawa East Africa au tambo anazunguka Kiswahili anaifahamu lakini it's time right now the world to turn around and look at our music my music na kuitazama hii ngoma kwa jicho lingine so nimefanya new version ambayo ni ya English so yeah itapatikana katika album pia so nikaona okay acha nifanye namba 3 au namba 4 kama sikosei lakini whatever the case as long as the song is there na kila mtu atayona na kuisikiza na kuipenda kio chief ni mtu ambaye anakusupport sana tunaona vitu vingi mnafanya mkiwa pamoja mm. lakini kitu ambacho kimeishangaza kidogo ni kuona kwamba kio chief hayupo kwenye album yako <laughs> sasa album it does any sio kwa sababu ya marafiki zangu no kio chief is my brother he's my inspiration lakini mimi na kio chief tuna project tumetoa ngoma tatu zimeitu tumetoka pamoja so tunapata mashabiki time kidogo lakini watu ambao tunafanya kazi kwa ukaribu sana mimi najifunza vitu vingi sana kupitia kio chief kwa sababu kio chief alikuwa katika industry miaka mingi amewa inspire sana wengi nikiwa mimi so na mimi day after day nazidi kujifunza kupitia yeye so ikifika wakati wa kutoa ngoma zingine we give them music no more talk no more time so tumepa tu watu kidogo wa wazizoe zile ngoma kwa sababu ngoma za moto zinafanya vizuri my boy inafanya vizuri god low inafanya vizuri nionyeshe mwenyezi Mungu amebariki sana chemistry imekuwa ni nzuri ngoma zote ambazo umestock kimba kwenye show watu wanaimba sio kitu rais so tunapa tu mashabiki time kidogo yeah we back again Uh, katika list ya watu ambao umewaalika ambao umeposti hatujaona watu ambao wako kwenye nyimbo zako wale ambao wako kwenye album like uh, wakina calligraph labda hatujaona je watakuepo hiyo Jumamosi uh, after the launch i'm doing something big this will come this is just exclusive and only for 500 people lakini mimi siimbi watu 500 kuna watu ambao wanaimbia na mimi wapo zaidi ya milioni mbili kwa Tanzania tu peke yake kuna wengine wapo Kenya Uganda so I'll do something special for them so wakati huo sasa ndo watakuja but for now 
this is just exclusive and nataka tu watu waone ambacho nimekiandalia eh nikibaki hapo hapo kwenye watu loaalika kuja kwenye hiyo event ama kuja kwenye ku launch album yeah. yako watu wengi ni wakubwa sana tukizungumzia mm. watangazaji wamealeka wakubwa Ndiyo. kutoka Kenya, Uganda mpaka Tanzania wasanii kutoka hapa Tanzania Ndiyo. watu mbalimbali wakubwa sana umejipangaje ili kufanya kitu kikubwa siku hiyo usiwaangushe watu loaalika pamoja na mashabiki zako i am a musician so it is a matter how man, who is there mean kazi yangu ni kuperform ni ku deliver kile ambacho ninacho uh, siwezi kujikweza nikataka nifanye kikubwa ambacho sina uwezo nacho kino kitu nakifanya basi ujue na uwezo nacho kufanya so nimejenda tu vizuri uh, creativity yeah it's, mean nadhani itakuwa ni vizuri yeah um itakuwa ni siku yako una launch album yako what about other artists watakuepo kwa ajili ya support like ile kuimba pia au ni wewe to the whole day I can be surprised so I want to be surprised <laughs> yeah Yes ngoma namba 14 mama ina reflect maisha halisi ya nyumbani kwenu au ya wazazi wako au ni mama tu katika mazingira yote That one goes to all beautiful mothers in the world it's not just for my mom for any mother in this world yeah so yeah man uh, katika list ya track ambazo zipo kwenye album yako kuna kunaonekana kuna utofauti wa sound sana yani ukiangalia list na track kuna baadhi ya nyimbo ambazo inaonekana kama umezirudia na umefanya na ma legend. Kitu gani kimekupa ugumu ama kitu gani kilikuwa kigumu katika uandaji wa sound ya ya, ya album yako? Kikweli nimetumia muda mwingi sana ku create the video, spend a lot of time with different producers, different studios just to make everything clear and to create something special. Uh, yani nataka sikio jipya, yani mtu akisikia anaona kabisa this is album so harmonize by yani just something different. Yani nataka kusema the next level. So ugumu ulikuepo kama unavyoona kwa kuona wasanii wengi sana mo collaboration and reason why nimefanya collaborations nyingi because my point and my wish is to take East African music to the world to another level ndio nimetumia muda mwingi sana uh, my regents kama walivyozungumza hapa Tanzania lakini pia wasanii wakubwa wa nje pia yeah ugumu ulikuepo sana so, uh, haikuwa easy uh, tunaamini kwamba we una collab na wasanii wengi sana wa nje na una connection tayari umeshakuwa mkubwa kwa kiasi fulani ni msanii gani ambaye umefanya naye kazi na ulitamani awepo kwenye album lakini muona no this is not the right time wacha nitoe album alafu yeye akae pembeni alafu baadaye tutaitoa hii ngoma Christmas hii ni surprise <laughs> ukitoa benda kwa nishaiwe kwenye album pia watu wanaangalia mbona hujaweka ya mtu fulani usingeweka tu but all in all mimi nimekuwa nikifanya kazi sana na mshukuru Mwenyezi Mungu my team management wamekuwa kiconsider sana mimi nafukuja na swala kazi nilikuwa nikijipush pushing myself like them pia wanani push kufanya kazi so nimekuwa nikifanya collab na wasanii tofauti tofauti so ikifika wakati uh, wa kutoa collab na wasanii wengine ndatoa lakini kwa sasa hivi ningependa zizifocus na kuziongelea sana hizi ambazo zipo kwenye album ngoma 18 za moto okay sorry uh, tamasha ambayo inaonekana yani usimbuzi wa album No 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 no. I have no pressure. But I'm sick. I any I'm, I'm excited. Yani cho nacho ni ile I can't wait. Sio pressure kwamba oh my god itakuwaje no. Yani I can't wait. Nataka watu waone the growth of my music career. Waone creativity, waone msanii wangu na hapo. Hicho ndio kinacho nacho kisubiri lakini sio pressure kwamba itakuwaje. I know. Yeah. Uh, of course na mshukuru Mwenyezi Mungu kwa sababu ni leo ndio kwa ni siku ya mwisho kuna fama mazoezi ya mwisho so everything is ready right now nitoka hapa tena hapa Mlimani City kwa go stage nadhani nimeambia imefika nusu so kwenda kuhakikisha tu mimi na yangu ya creativity pamoja na engineering kwenda kuangalia kwamba okay na tunachokitaka ndio hichi kwa sababu stage itakuwa ni tofauti kidogo stage itakuwa tofauti na the style style yenyewe ambayo tunaenda ku launch album naweza nikasema haijawahi ku fanyika itakuwa different kidogo so nataka muda nitafanya nenda pale kukagua lakini kisha nitakuwa nafanya sound check kuanzia mimi na mchana nitakapo pale mpaka usiku yeah uh, kuna wimbo malaika ukiwa na Morgan Heritage hii ilikufanya utoe wimbo kwa sababu ya ile ulivyoimbaka kwenye Bongo Star Search malaika watu wakakucheka ama ilikuwaje no, I love the song and malaika is angel angel is just something else not normal and ukisikia malaika angel ni kitu tofauti kabisa so I love the song and it was my dream to sing that song and finally we here. Yeah. Sha kwanza kabisa mimi sio tofauti watu 500 ambao nimewalika na wale ambao hawajapata mwaliko. 
and they are not special kwa sababu kila mtu kwangu mimi ni special everyone who love my music support me hata wale ambao wanipendi kwangu mimi ni special I what i believe ni about time na bahati na risk tu ya mtu imefika so risk ya mzee wasiko alla mlango wazi lakini najitahidi i'm trying my best to create kitu kingine ambacho kitakuwa ni kikubwa ambacho kitaweka watu pamoja hata kuanzia fam 60 f60 lakini hata nikifanya hivyo pia nitakao watu wote bado hawajafanya nini hawajatosha kwa sababu Tanzania na watu zaidi ya milioni 62 na uwezi kufanya show ya watu milioni 62 haijawahi kutokea nzima so yeah kwa hiyo they are not special na they are special kwa sababu mimi na nakubali support ya kila mtu so ni, ni about time tu kama nilivyosema Uh, so ikifika wakati mwingine wazamu kwa zamu kwenda wazamu kwa wengine pia nitaalika wengine pia na maisha yataendelea lakini swala kusema uh, ngoma za za kiingereza zipo 12 za <laughs> watanzania wa leo kwa kiingereza sio kweli kwa sababu uh, kiingereza ni inaweza nikasema ni universal language whatever yani wewe unakoenda na i think is right time to sisi ku extend muziki wetu pia tuweza tukafikisha muziki wetu kwa Kiswahili sio kitu kibaya as unajua muziki ni universal language eh? mtu wenda sielewi lakini aka yani akawa tu ana dance na ana feel to the melody lakini sio mbaya muda mwingine kuweka maneno ambayo atamfanya aelewe kwa sababu inamfanya apende zaidi kwa sababu uh, mimi naonaga kuna ngoma zinatigi za kiswa, za kinejili nzazi kaiti afu sio yenye tuka tukazitiaga tu maneno yani ngoma ya Kiingereza imeita afu sisi tunaitia maneno kiswa yetu tunaibadilisha tunatamani tunatamani tuimbe yani kama wao walivyoimba wenyewe lakini tunashindwa tunatia maneno ya, ki, ya Kiswahili kama toe mfano ngoma ngoma za kina peace kuna ngoma imeiti sana ni mtu una uh, unafanya yani unatamani ile neno lake uligeuze ile kwa Kiswahili yani u, ulijue kwa jikuta tu unaimba kama freestyle nikikumbuka baadhi ya ngoma zanga kuimbia lakini nadhani na unaelewa ninachokimaanisha eh yeah, so ni vizuri kuweka maneno mengine pia watu wengine pia uelewe what you talking about lakini sio sio kukikacha na Kiswahili na kuimba Kiingereza so hata ngoma ambazo zinakigeza ndani yake ukichunguza kuna maneno ya Kiswahili mengi na naamini pia watu sasa hivi wanapanuka sana kwa sababu hata watoto wengi wako international school kutana watoto kumi sasa hivi uh, nane wanajua Kiingereza wawili hajui so katika baada ya miaka mitano wale wanakuja kuwa mashabiki so ukiwa tu unaimba Kiswahili sana bila kuwachanganyia kidogo na kwa kama huko nao unaweza ukapea uleji ndio wakati muda wako hujafika kule <laughs> kama nilivyosema uh, mimi ni mtanzania na lengo langu ni ku una muziki wa Tanzania unaenda mbali doesn't matter kwa ni imbe lugha gani ni imbe kiportugeezi kileno kiingereza ni kwa tu muziki wa Tanzania unaenda mbali kwa sababu mimi nikifika sehemu ku perform itaandikwa pale harmonize from Tanzania it doesn't matter kwa una imbe lugha gani so unajaribu tu ku mix wao wapende muziki wangu lakini pia waelewe na maanisha kitu gani kwa sababu naamini kabisa wakielewa ninachokiimba maneno wakielewa watapenda zaidi so yeah nimekuwa nikifanya collaboration na Zion Tofauti Tofauti lakini Nigeria nimekuwa nikienda mara kwa mara ndani kwa kuona niona mara kwa mara wananiona na wasanii tofauti tofauti ambao wamekuwa kama marafiki zangu sasa hivi ndio maana huwa na consider sana kuona kwamba kwa Tanzania sababu na kwa sababu wananiona mara kwa mara na role na wasanii wao na collaborations zao nimekuwa nikifanya mara kwa mara hicho ndio kinafanya waseme kwamba hamna hizi is number one. okay uh, uki, ukiangalia soko la <laughs> well, mastering yani mastering haibadilishi testa. Yani kitu ambacho kinapeleka sound kule ni production na maanisha producers. So kwenye albamu yangu karibu ngoma 16 zote wamefanya wa producer wa Tanzania. Ngoma mbili tu moja amefanya na Chris Beat kutoka Nigeria na mmoja amefanya na uh, The Nax from London lakini amefanya na kina Bonga, Anta, uh, Yankees Molento aba wote ni wa Tanzania. So tunapeleka ile sound lakini kuongezea zaidi kwamba tunapeleka mziki wa Tanzania kule. Tumeka na ngoma ya Singeli pia. Singeli is a typical Tanzanian sound. So tunapeleka mziki wetu kule lakini pia most atufocus na wale tunafocus na sisi wenyewe. Tuna create vitu ambavyo tunavipenda. Mimi tukivipenda sisi wao watavipenda pia. Okay. Uh, streaming online kusiana album ama album mauzo ya online sina tatizo na wewe ama siwezi kuwa na tatizo juu ya mauzo ya album online. Watanzania wengi sana na wasanii wengi sana wamekuwa waoga kupeleka album zao hadi kopi mtaani kuziuza na soko ukiangalia kitanzania limekuwa ni gumu kidesign fulani. Wewe umejipangaje kuipeleka album yako kumfikia kila mtu kwa sababu wewe ni msanii ambaye unapendwa na kila lika. So 
umejipanga vipi kumfikia kila mtanzania na kwenye swala zima la hard copy kwenye swala mauzo unajua sasa kuna copy na kupesi na nini na vitu kama hivyo kwa mimi najitahidi au try my best kuhakikisha kwamba kila mtanzania na kila sehemu tunapata so kama sasa hivi pre-order ishaanza online spotify itunes wapi ana pre-order so kama uja pre-order album naenda sasa kwa pre-order lakini najitahidi kiasi album ikitoka tu kuna mfumo ambao utatengenezwa a uh, copy is the talkers of flash pamoja na cd zitafika kila mtu yeah kisha mwisho cha kuambia mashabiki zako kabla ya jumamosi ambapo ndo album launching yenyewe kikweli mimi nashukuru sana nimekuwa pamoja na mimi kongo uh, kin support nikiona mawazo mapya lakini hata mawazo ya zamani pia uh, wananifanya ni pata hope na kuona kabisa kwamba i'm doing this not only support talk behind me yeah, so nashukuru sana ombe tuende ku support This is just beginning and I believe I have long way to go and dona za tumziki wangu harmonize is nobody without them and MC can support me so kwa mtu yote so and then can support kununga mkono as human being mda mwingine kiteleza sameki binadamu lakini kipatia pia usisite kunipongeza so na mimi itani motivate haito nivimbisha kichwa but itani motivate na kunifanya niongeze kazi kwa bidii kikubwa ndo hicho nashukuru sana I love the comic on the boy excuse on the tembo yeshi from the most expensive could again for everybody on love